Greetings, everyone. Uh, I'm making this video because I've seen uh, several comments cropping up the last couple of weeks um, in reference to a website called Manhood Academy, as well as a channel which is linked to that called 101, 101 Principles. Now, most recently today, I uh, I saw a comment on one of my chat on one of my videos where the gentleman said something to the effect of that man manhood academy is the solution to being a mangina or something like that. And I wrote in response that you know based I had glimpsed the site before and I had, I've certainly looked at the cha channel 101 principles and I'll put post links to them of course. And I and it, to my eye to what I read and saw and sort of absorbed it just seemed like a different version of PUA. And so I explained that to him, and his response, which I think is quite typical, yep, you definitely sound like a faggot mangina raised by a single mommy, put your tampons back in little girl ha. So no argumentation there, of course. I also responded again, and basically, by, or, or offered a more forceful argument. He didn't offer any response because, of course, he can't argue. But um, I thought I should make my subscribers and everyone watching this aware of this website. Now, this website called uh, Man Giant, uh, sorry, Manhood Academy, is, uh, it's, it, you would have to be pretty dumb not to see through it. I mean, it, it claims to be critical of the PA community and what have you. But I mean, I'll just read off uh, what, uh, what it says. Train with us. I mean, it's about training. You're supposed to train yourself as a man. You're drowning in a sea of confusing advice, prescription meds and chronic insecurity. You're obsessed with your appearance and ruled by your unstable emotions. You dread talking to women. You resent your peers and couldn't care less about the world. In short, you feel stuck and unable to do anything about it. Your frustration is understandable. We're here to cut through the bullshit. Manhood Academy is the first worldwide, worldwide male educational center specifically designed to train men like you in social competence. Now, it should be glaringly apparent that so social competence here is totally synonymous with with the, the PUA line, what do women want and how do I get laid? That's what, really what they mean. And best of all, our content is absolutely free. Mm, I, that might be the case. I'm not going to argue that. Whether it's going on your first date, uh -huh, saving a troubled relationship, uh -huh, addressing your wife's bitch behavior, uh -huh, making new friends or standing up for yourself in, the, in this emasculating feminist environment, our goal is to teach you how to conduct satisfying social interaction. So, yes, it's about getting pussy, basically, at the end of the day. Um, they, uh, you see a lot of co-oping of MRA uh, terminology within the PUA community, and this I think see this as an offshoot of the PUA, uh, whereby they they use terms like emasculating feminist environment and so on and so forth. But it should be, as I said, glaringly apparent, very obvious when you read through this to see what this is really about. This website, Manhood Academy, it's, it's, it's ridiculously stupid in my opinion. Uh, going on about how to train yourself to be socially competent. Uh, socially competent, of course, just means being able to pick up women, being able to please women. And if you don't think that's what this is about, even though they talk about feminism and what have you, and they have in this one channel called uh, 101 Principles, an extension of manhoodacademy.com, uh, you have, uh, the, they criticize the seduction community scam. Um, they call it a seduction community scam, so they're criticizing PUA. However, one major video which really, feminism teaches women, I mean, so they talk about the stuff. They have one video called How Women View Male Authority. And then in that video, they literally say what women find attractive and what women don't find attractive. And we should, and we as men should, of course, find this out. We should ascertain this so we can present ourselves in the proper manner to women. I saw videos how to kill your inner mangina, and so on and so forth. Physical expression, how you express yourself. All of this geared to acquiring vaginal assets. I mean, it's, it's patently obvious. Now, when I pointed out to the gentleman who called me a faggot mangina with tampons up, up my ass, uh, that the, if anyone's a mangina, and I don't like the term, it would be him, because I don't give a rat's ass what any woman thinks. I simply ignore them, don't pay attention to them, and they have no bearing on my life whatsoever. That is to say, I have no interaction with them. I just don't care. So, I mean, he had no response to that. And I think it should be obvious. And if you've chosen to go your own way, if you come across this site or people trying to sell you these manhood principles, these manhood academy principles, training,
just remember that all of this stuff is just a form of PUA. It's, 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 part, it's an extension of the pickup artist community. They talk about emasculation, but what they really mean is it's all man up to man up. You need to man up so you can get women. Um, of course, if you've chosen the route of MGTOW, well, that, all that stuff is irrelevant. This stuff might be irrelevant if people want to get, if guys just want to get laid. Um, and, but, uh, you know, I, I just thought I'd point this out because it, it should be very obvious. But this, I've seen a couple of comments cropping up where, referen where reference is made to, uh, to this uh, website and to the, uh, the channel on how men should man up. I mean, had uncle d disciplines nephew, and so on. So, you know, basically how to be, how to be an old-fashioned traditionalist male. How to put women in their place, so on and so forth. So, I just thought I should make people aware of that. You can look at the site yourself. The Principles, free ebook. I, mean, I, I just, videos, forum, reviews, you can See it yourself. I don't know who these people are, but I mean, it's signed off with Dr. Lidice and Professor Plum. I'm highly, highly doubtful that they're actually doctors and professors, but you know, you could be the judge. Uh, they're supposedly here to cut through the bullshit. Well, this video is here to cut through the bullshit of manhoodacademy.com and 101 principles. Um, look, if you've chosen to go in your way, you just don't. We don't care what women want. So it, all the stuff is irrelevant. Um, and it, it's funny how the PUA community will re resort to the same kind of um, ad hominems, insults, and deflections that uh, most feminists do. Of course, they don't use that exact terminology, but you know, you're, you're a faggot, you tap tampon, so on and so forth, you're a mangina. But once again, I pose the question, is, is the mangina the man who and on some levels, he's still to count out a female desire so he can measure up to their standards, so he can acquire their vaginal assets, or someone who's just chosen to ignore it all and just do his own thing. I mean, you be just be the judge of that. But um, yeah, just be aware of this website in case you start seeing comments. Or I mean, I, I think they probably they do a lot of advertising too. I, I'm deeply suspicious of whether or not it's actually free, but who knows? Maybe it is free. I don't know. Anyway, that's all I have to say. Pretty, I try to make this video brief. Just be aware of this website, and be aware of the many layers of PUA, because at the end of the day, it's all the same, but it, it can be kind of confusing in some respects. Um, they claim not to be part of the PUA community, but they basically are. Anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, well, yeah, thanks for watching.